called fantasy football, but players take it very seriously. And it's big business, generating over a billion dollars in revenue annually. At a recent event organized by Intel in San Francisco, an expert panel, including famed 49er Jerry Rice, explained how data and technology are changing the way fantasy football is played. The 1,500 catches that I had over... For many, fantasy football is a game of numbers. Lots of numbers. Sports technology company Stats calculates 92 data points during each play of a football game. And that information has actually been available for a while, but it's been cost prohibitive to make it available to the average fantasy football player because the technology was so expensive. So Intel's role is to drive down the cost of the technology, uh, increase the capability of the technology so that it becomes accessible to everybody. Take it from a pro football hall of famer. The data makes a difference. It takes it to a whole different level, you know, because the fans, they have access to that now. And it's just going to make the, the situation a little bit more, you know, competitive because now they have all that data. It's the same data that head coaches use to manage their offense and defense. Researchers at Intel are also creating analytics tools to help crunch all that big data. Welcome news for fantasy football veterans. But for newbies who are feeling a little lost as they make their draft picks, here's a little professional advice. It's productivity. You know, I, I want to see a receiver, the yardage you have to catch. Uh, also, how many catches, uh, how many yards, all of that. And the same thing with a quarterback. You know, you want to see how many touchdowns a quarterback is going to throw, uh, you know, his uh, passer rating, uh, you know, his uh, accuracy. And in case you were wondering, Rice is picking the 49ers to go all the way. In San Francisco, I'm Sumi Das, CNET.com for CBS News.